Good afternoon, you guys. This is Amber with Amber Poetry and Song again. Uh, I have another word. It's a prophetic vision that I had um, on July 17, 2021. So um, I'm going to read it to you, and then I'm going to read something that I shared on my Facebook. So on July 17, 2021, um, I saw, wait a minute, wrong place. July 17, 2021, at 12, 17, uh, I saw like a, sc a screen before you were about to record a TikTok. Um, and then I saw a blackout of the screen. You know how when you go to TikTok and it has a little plus sign at the bottom and you hit that to go and record your video, how the screen appears and has the icons on the side that's what i saw and then i saw the screen black out and so uh when i saw this it reminded me of a dream that i had uh last year and so this is and it caused me to research some things too and also off of confirmation of others that um have had similar um words on this pertaining to some to a blackout that's supposed to happen. And so um, I'm sharing this with y'all, not for fear. Uh, I believe it's a warning um, for us to prepare. And so this is what I put on March, uh, March 25th, 2020. I had this dream, King, Kim Jong-un, I'm not to say his name, he's the leader of North Korea, was after me, trying to kill me. Um, when I first wrote this down in my notebook, I put China. It was, it wasn't, it was a mix up. Like, because at first I called him Chung Lee and, and I didn't mean anything by that, but I thought that was his name. <laughs> and so that's what I put in my notebook. But when I looked up his name, I realized he's the leader of, of North Korea. So I correct that. Um, but he was after me trying to kill me. And I also saw like this modern day tower of Babel in my dream. Um, I shared this before on Facebook. Now, when I first wrote this in my notebook, I didn't go into detail, but I, but I remember this and this tower was black and white. And I saw the guy Kim and it looked like men in ninja attire trying to get into my home, uh, my current home. Um, I didn't understand at first, but over time, God has caused me to understand through confirmation from others in research. I also had a vision the other day during prayer time, um, which is the vision I just mentioned to y'all about TikTok. I'm just rereading what I posted on my Facebook. So I looked up who owns TikTok. It, it, it is owned by a Chinese parent company called ByteDance. There's an article about the CEO stepping down in May of 2021, and it has an overseas office in Santa Monica, California. Um, I believe there's going to be a blackout, um, basically something called an EMP attack, and it's going to come from China or North Korea or that area. From what I understand, the reason is because of the desire for power and control. I'm not sure how big of an impact this will be, but this is what was shown to me Plus, others have been talking about this as well. Um, an EMP is a burst of an electromagnetic radiation, typically generated by a high altitude nuclear explosion or nuclear or non nuclear device. An EMP attack will destroy the electronics and digital circuitry in the area of impact, denying electric power to our homes, businesses, and military. Um, I put, this means you would need non-perishable foods and items to survive for however long it would last and would need to be prepared. Um, I researched a few things. Um, North Korea borders China and Russia to the north and South Korea to the south. And with this, I was led to Genesis chapter 11, verses 1 through 9, about the Tower of Babel. Um, it reminds me of the whole story of the Tower of Babel. And those people reminds me of a one world order. Um, and so I also looked up China's political system, which is republic, then it's unitary state, then socialist state, 
then a one party state and then the the leadership for uh korea is a dictatorship of people's democracy which is they're under the leadership of the workers party of korea basically given legal supremacy over um political parties i believe that's why i saw this tower of babel in that dream um and i also have some articles that i will um post on this video below that you can follow um i also screenshotted some stuff from that i posted on facebook but since i'm doing a vid video i won't be able to add that into the video um unless i was to do one without my face showing and so um trump actually tried to do something about a potential emp tech back in 2019 so all of this kind of had me wondering, because at one point Trump was trying to get rid of TikTok. I couldn't help but to think that um, maybe that's why he was trying to um, ban TikTok, the use of TikTok in the U.S. I don't know, though, but that, that was just a thought that came to mind when I was looking all this up and I and I found those things. And so. I'm going to post those links below. Um, another sister on here, I actually did a video. It's called Be Alert, EMP Attack, Blackout. Um, from her initial word on October 14, 2019. Um, that was one of the screenshots I referenced to because I shared that on my Facebook. And then I shared a, um article about Kim Jong, and that's when I mentioned it was on March 26 when I shared this this article, but I mentioned the dream about him after me um, in that dream. And it, this article says Kim Jong orders to shoot a person who tests positive for coronavirus. So um, those are the two screenshots that I used on there. But um, right after I shared this the next day um, during, what time was it? I don't think it was the next day. I think it was that evening. Let me see. Um, oh no, it was, it was July 18th and it was at 11.06 PM. Yeah, July 18th at 11.06 PM. I had another vision um, in the vision, I saw 11, 11, like, like the clock time, 11, 11, and then I saw China. And so God only uh, gives me, you know, a, a little bit, um, but I feel like that was confirmation um, from the other vision that I had and with this, this dream with me um, posting about it. I saw 11, 11, and then China. And then I had another dream, but I still need to, I need to ask God about that dream um, because it's tied into this some kind of way, but um, I don't have the full understanding of it yet. So that's all I needed to share. Um, like I said, the scripture that I was brought to was Genesis. Hang on. Genesis chapter 11, verses 1 through 9. Um, basically, the people all spoke one language and wanted to, to you know, I'm, I'm going to read it. I'm going to read the, I'm going to go to the scripture and read it. Genesis chapter 11. verses one through nine it says and the whole earth was of one language and of one speech and it came to pass as they journeyed from the east that they found a plain in the land of shinar and they dwelt there and they said one to another go to let us make brick and burn them thoroughly and they had brick for stone and slime had they for mortar and they said, go to, let us build us a city and a tower whose top may reach into heaven and let us make us a name. Thus we be scattered abroad upon the face of the whole earth. And the Lord came down to see the city and the tower, which the children of men builded. 
And the Lord said, Behold, the people is one, and they have all one language. And this they begin to do, and now nothing will be restrained from them which they have imagined to do. Go to, let us go down and there confound their language, that they may not understand one another's speech. So the Lord scattered them abroad from thence upon the face of all the earth, and they left off to build the city. Therefore is the name of it called Babel, because the Lord did there confound the language of all the earth. And from thence did the Lord scatter them abroad upon the face of the earth. Basically, man wanted, man wanted to, they want to make a name for themselves. Um, and like I said, this reminded me of one world, of a one world order. Um, it, it has to do with wanting power, wanting, wanting power, wanting control, wanting to exceed God. Um, which, which is what basically what Satan did um, in the Bible. Um, he he wanted to be, you know, greater than God. Um, but I believe that this dream, that it's it's talking about this dream and these visions is talking about a blackout that's gonna possibly happen. Um, I think from it people need to be prepared like stocking up on water non-perishable foods items um because it's going to cause a power outage like it's gonna it's gonna cause the power to go out and you won't be able to use things like your cell phone your laptop your lights and i don't know when this is going to happen or how far of an impact it will be but those are the dreams and the visions that God showed me. And so, um, and then there are other people mentioning the same thing. So it's something that we all need to take heed to um, as far as preparing to make sure that, that, you know, you have what you need to be able to survive if there is a blackout. Um, but yeah, this reminded me of, of a one world order um, that is possibly it, it's because of power and control and, and TikTok some kind of way. Um, well, I read it to you. TikTok is owned by a Chinese parent company. It's, it's all linking back to China, basically, uh, is what I'm getting from that and from what I looked up is linking back to China. And so, yeah, this is just a word to be prepared to. So, so you be aware to be prepared. Um, I'm not sure when this is going to happen, but I first had that dream a year ago in March. And then this year, um, I just had these visions. So just be aware. So, um, I hope y'all have a blessed day. See y'all later. Goodbye.